There he goes again, an 11-year-old behind the wheel of his parents' car, leading police on a dangerous high-speed chase. And it's not the first time he's done it. Five on your side, investigator Scott Knoll live in the newsroom with more on what he's found. Yeah, incredibly, this is the third time in just over a year this kid's parents say he's taken their cars. This time, investigators say he was mad at his mom for taking away his PlayStation. Brooklyn police spotted the SUV just before 11 last night. I have vehicles running on me. Within seconds, the chase is on. The driver running red lights, shutting his off and speeding through town. Pulling away from me, I'm doing 75. What no one realized, the driver, just 11 years old. Investigators say he took his mom's car after she went to bed. A joyride with a crashing end. Cops say the boy, who was no longer being chased, wasn't paying attention and slammed into a parked pickup in Cleveland about 20 minutes later. The 11-year-old treated, then released from the hospital. That's when investigators got another surprise. The boy's parents say he's the same kid who led troopers on this 50-mile chase along the turnpike last October, just days after taking his mom's car and leaving it with flat tires on I-90. That time, his dad said his son did it, thinking it was a joke and that nothing would happen to him. His mom told investigators he was charged for taking the car, but the case was dropped after the boy wasn't competent to stand trial. Police aren't releasing the boy's name since he is a minor. Investigators say they plan to seek felony charges against the 11-year-old for this latest chase. Live in the newsroom, I'm 5 on your side, Investigator Scott Knoll.